Hi everybody out there. So, uh, Dora the Explorer is in the news today, and I'm talking about this because I'm a dad and I have a daughter that watches uh, Dora the Explorer. And um, so I guess there's going to be a new grown-up version of her coming out. And uh, parents, some parents are protesting this. You know, some parents just need like a self-righteous cause, um, you know, something to bitch about. And um, I don't have a problem with this because once a little girl hits like five or six, they're moving on to um, to brass dolls that dress like hookers. Um, you know, my, my daughter's got a couple of them, and I'm fine with that because as a parent, it's not it's not my job. I mean, it's not the, the toy company's job to, um, to, to teach your kids right from wrong and such. Uh, it's my job. And, um, you know, I, I don't have a problem with my daughter playing with Brad dolls, but, you know, I'd rather have her playing with the new Dora doll. Um, you know, th these parents that, um, these parents that, you know, are protesting this, these are the same douchebags that, are. Uh, uh, that made it so the kids can't play uh, tag in the schoolyard. Um, it's the pussification of our country, really, because there's eight-year-old kids in the Middle East who are uh, shooting AK-47s, and um, our kids can't even play bombardment in the schoolyard anymore, um, which we all played as kids, um, you know, and we turned out fine. Um, it, it, it's just, it's turning our, you know, it's making our kids a bunch of, uh, you know, little crybabies it's going to end up being. Um, you know, I wouldn't, uh, I'd have no problem with my kids, put my kid playing tag or bombardment, just like I did, just like my parents did, just like your parents did. So, you know, there's that, and, um, <clears throat> you know, now, the new door's still going to go on adventures, and, um, you know, it's not going to be like, uh, you know, she's not going to be going uh, shopping for shoes and, and dating and stuff. It's still going to be the same door adventures, like a Nancy Drew, I guess, um, which is fine with me. Um, I don't know about you out there, but that's, that's, uh, that's okay with me. Now, on the other side of the spectrum, there's the um, Bobby dolls, the, these little hooker dolls they're coming out with. Um, they come complete with short skirts and tramp stamps. Um, so, I don't, I'd, rather, I'd rather have my kid playing with the Dora doll. But, um, you know, toy companies are just trying to sell products. And, and um, I'm sure that my daughter is going to have at least one of each of the three dolls that I, I talked about here. And that's fine with me um, because... Well, basically, I'm Super Dad, and I have full confidence that I'm going to teach my daughter, um, you know, uh, good values, and I'm not going to leave it up to the toy companies or the cartoon networks or anything like that. Um, so, you know, I, I don't know. I'm just going to let it be, really. Um, you know, I don't understand these parents that just find this need to, to, to bitch and cry about everything. But anyway, um, so, I don't know. I'm on, I'm all for this new Dora because my daughter is going to be growing out of the young Dora. And, uh, you know, right now she has the brat dolls, but she doesn't really play with, she plays with them, she doesn't understand. Uh, you know, she's three. But, uh, there's nothing wrong with a uh, with a uh, little grown-up version of the new Dora, of uh, Dora the Explorer, um, and all you douchebag parents, man, just you, know, you need to get a life. Your kid's gonna be fine, you, you know. The, whatever. Anyway, so that's all for today. All right.